is Black Friday, and normally I would not leave the house for anything, but I am leaving today because I have early access to the release of the Union Jordan. Shout out to my friends at Foot Action who invited me down to Jumpman LA. I'm gonna cop some kicks. We have that early access, and you already know I'm bringing you with me. Let's go. I ran into the homie, Jacques, AKA. What up, what up, what up? The man behind the sneaker YouTube. Stop it. Question okay. for your expert opinion. Uh -oh. Would you consider this, the Union Jordan, one of the top sneakers of the year? Uh, based on the hype that it's gotten and how crazy people are going for these, yes. It's insane. Like, I never expected it to be like this. Yeah. Um, and even like the release online, it was like people are going crazy for these. It's really interesting to see. I, like, I saw them and I was like, oh, those are dope. Because, you know, they did that really cool flea market fake out video, which I thought was actually. Absolutely. Um, but I, I didn't think they were going to get this hype. I didn't either. Like, for Jordan, especially because Jordans haven't been, like, crazy hype. Like, outside right. of, like, the off-white Jordan ones, True. nothing else really had this sort of, like, energy to it. Yeah. And these kind of, like, build. It was, like, building kind of under. It was, like, building underneath. And then, like, once they released, it was, like, crazy. I mean, part of that has to do with the resale, obviously. Right. Um, but it's also just, like, a dope project. Man, Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan. Bye. I gotta ask you, would you consider this sneaker one of the top sneaker drops of the year? I would think so, like considering the hype behind it and also just the creativity of the shoe itself. I think it's definitely one of the better releases this year. I think personally for me, I think it's one of the better ones, the best maybe. Like compared to like all of the other stuff that's been coming out, like collabs just like it's kind of come and gone. There's way too many, and it really takes a lot to stand out. And this is the one that stands out. This will be your ticket. All you gotta do is hop in line for me. And we'll take care of you. <laughs> Thank you. All right, so let's hop in line. I hope you guys had fun. This was, you know, awesome, obviously, being invited in and coming in for friends and family. You got to meet some of my really good friends that I've met through my love of sneakers. Um, I got some really dope kicks. I'm so excited for these. I honestly thought that I was going to be fighting for these on StockX, but I got in. I got in early. I got them for retail, and now I get to be fly. All right, guys, so like I said before, like, subscribe, comment. And many of them always be really rocking. Make sure you subscribe to our channel. She lit. Hey. And Brittany's channel. Yes, Brittany Elena. Subscribe. It's lit. Millie Rock. Hey. Queen, queen. Always ones. One life. So I interviewed Brittany for Complex two years ago. No. Yeah, like about two years ago. Two years ago. And then I saw her again through MTV when I was testing TRL. Yeah. 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 Look, we be working all yes. busy, trying to make moves. Brittany out here shining. She's interviewing Kobe. She's on tour with Kevin Hart. I see you. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to get like you, me. <laughs> Girl, you out here doing big things, but you know, women, that's what we do. We out here just trying to make sure that we're making moves, be inspirational, mm -hmm. and role models yes. for the younger generation. That's what we're doing. We're here to inspire. As yes. Aspire to inspire, I yes. like to say. Yes. All right, I'm done. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye, babe. And now we really out.